Hey, what's going on, everybody? In this part of the video, I'm just gonna be taking this brush guard off, taking the inside of the wheel well out, just taking my measurements, showing you exactly where I'm gonna be putting everything, and then uh, just going from there. So I'll just keep you guys informed as we go. So he had rock lights on here before, so what I did is right here, I made a little X. Right here I made an X that's 18 and a half inches apart. Same thing that I have on the rear, so all my light gaps are equal. All right, so for right now all I have is I have both rock lights in, I have the wires ran down, and I use this test the tape and they're all wired up together. So then I'll run it underneath the truck to the cab and then same for every other wheel well. So what I'm doing is I started running the wires across here and in here. I found a perfect spot right where the e-brake wire is. I can go right here and I can drill out this hole and then my wire's gonna come through here, but I'm gonna put a grommet here because you never want your wire to ever start getting frayed down and can short out. All right, so I have the sub box here. We have two 12 inch E-series. Then we also have a prefabricated box just for this truck to fit in here. It's lined next to match his bed and then Get ready to slide that in here. I did take the carpeting out just so it does because it has all that pad on the bottom. So I just want to make sure it fits as tight as possible. Give us enough room because um, we're just hoping it doesn't hit the bottom of those seats. So I just ran the wire this way. It's gave him slack so this would never get yanked out. Ran across here and doubled them up together. Ran some test tapes, so looks real clean. So after it's laying down, whenever he goes to bring it up, right there, and he'll be able to at least lean these forward. 